reports that some celebrities knew about Tabo Besta being out of prison when he's supposed to be dead and six feet under are growing by the day. At the rate that this story has been unfolding, I wouldn't be surprised if it came out that at least one of the most well-known people knew Besta and Nandipa's story, but kept quiet. It's weird how I can remember seeing one celeb in particular posting about Dr. Nandipa's birthday, but now that picture has vanished from the face of the earth. One well-known and established person has either been milking this Tavo story for her gain at all cost, or she is very dumb to expose herself knowing she could face prison. Hi, T-Squad, and welcome to the T-World. Reality TV star, businesswoman and author, her P. Similane has come out to tell the world how proud she is of herself for never giving in to best tricks and standing her ground. In an article by The South African, she talked about meeting Tabo and how she never fell for his tricks. She further added on Mapepandava that she had voice notes and videos of him secretly taking videos of her in their meeting. I even have voice notes and a video of him taking me a video in secret. Nandipa even called me herself to loo me, said her P. She also said Besta was promising her a job in United States while secretly taking a picture of her. She could have been human trafficked if her assistant didn't see what Besta was doing. All this because Nandipa Magudumana lured her into his trap. My thing is, Nandi might have lured her, but she still met with him and did not report him to the police. He was a criminal on the loose after all. And the restaurant they met at was lavish. This guy has been living his dream life right under the noses of law enforcement. Now, isn't Happy Simelane part of the long list of people who help hide a known criminal by not reporting that he is in fact roaming the streets? And that's it for now. Do leave your comments down below. I love you.